I got it. <laughs> I knew I would. <laughs> Y'all, I have failed vlogging for what is today? Today is Tuesday, I think. I think it's Tuesday. Sunday. Sunday, I puked my guts out, y'all. I was so sick. I do know why. It was my own fault. You know, I know I've got a messed up gallbladder, but I was pushing my luck and I ate. Uh, this is so gross. I ate all that, ugh, like laughing hurts so much every muscle my stomach muscles my rib muscles my neck muscles my back even my elbow muscles hurt y'all i'm sure i must have looked like an alien was leaving my body oh my god i got a sore down here you know how you hit your uh, gums with the toothbrush it's made a sore and i can't hardly talk anyway all right y'all i have managed to get out of bed and um Y'all look at this. This is uh, the uh, the lady at our Walmart wears one of these. Y'all, it's a fan. You hang it around your neck. Oops. It hangs around your neck and look, it blows. Let's see if you can see it blowing. This is amazing. I took it to. We went to um, the balloon race last year. Like it's in August, and August in Texas is aka hell so that came in real handy uh but as you can see i've got stuff stacked everywhere this is all of chloe's stuff i've been digging through all that we are trying to get um our my bedroom redone uh it you know how it i, I don't know like it's when it when it rains it pours we're trying to get our bedroom redone but um our air condition has gone out in the house we uh this past saturday we had to go to arkansas for a funeral the saturday before that we went to arkansas for a family reunion so it's been busy we don't dan doesn't have a lot of time off and when he does have time off we've had things that we've had to go do and um uh, so yeah i was i was hoping to have carpet put in by now but needless to say there's no carpet and uh i'm not sure i'll have to see how much the air condition is going to cost to get fixed and we're also flying to colorado so yeah we just got money flying out all over the place right this minute so my bedroom is having to wait because that's not necessary. Well, the trip is not necessary either. But, you know, we've already booked it, so we're going to do it. And, uh, and then I got sick. Hadn't felt good there. But, hopefully, we will get the house put back together because it is driving. I hate to have crap stacked everywhere like this. Um... You know, I am taking Chloe with me. I take Chloe everywhere I go. And so, I have been di trying to dig out her paperwork. I, I have most of her paperwork, but I know there was this one piece that um, I had it in, in on my nightstand in my bedroom. And when I broke my bedroom apart so that I could start redoing it. I don't know where that, that piece of paper, it was basically the toe tag, you know, and that's probably, if they're going to want some of the paperwork, that's probably what they're going to want. And, uh, so yeah, I don't know what I'm, I've got, um, I found, I found, look at this, I had, it, I had all of our stuff put together and I found, uh, there's this in here, 
and it's got the little metal medallion. There's a metal medallion in there with her, and then this is the matching one so that we know it's her. And then there's a a, a, a thing saying like her the date she passed and stuff like that, and that she was cremated. So I don't know. I saw her patch of hair in there. I don't know why I do that to myself. I told them I didn't want any of her hair. And they, they got a piece of it anyway. Here I am fixing to jack my makeup up before I ever get it on. Let me stop this. Anyway, I am taking her with me, and I'm going to take what paperwork I have found and just hope for the best. Um, I, don't, I don't anticipate it being a problem because she's so little. She's in my purse all the time. I'm using y'all for a camera. I mean, for a mirror. My mirror is over here, but this works as good, if not better. And, uh... Yeah, she's little. She fits in my purse, so I can't imagine. I mean, uh, I don't know if they're gonna make me dump my purse. I have no idea. I haven't. I haven't done this, so I don't know what they're gonna do. But um, I'll deal with it when it happens. And I know that may sound stupid, but um, I'm taking you know like that that matches the little disc. That's, uh, I mean, the most that they'll do is. Uh, x-ray my purse and they'll see that little metal disc inside that box and uh, maybe be curious. I can't look over here. I look in this mirror. And be curious what that is. So uh, that was a NYX liner in 831. I get asked about this a lot and I don't always do this, but I'm going to do it today. I have no idea what this is. It's, uh, like there's hardly any writing left on it. It's just a real cheap, uh, I think there was the pack. It was a package of two at Fred's and it's like in a brown color. And then I just come in here and like, that was a liner and now I'm going to line it real thin with this. So you can't even really see it. Okay, I do that, and then I take uh, this thing right here. It is a, uh, what's the cheap uh, elf? It's an elf, but it's a sponge. And then I take and blend those two together. I'm from the 80s, and I like the look. Of lined lips and then this is a NYX uh, butter gloss in I have no idea can you see what that says it's eclair that's what it is I don't know the number it's eclair it's the color is eclair I don't know the number that's what I did for that um let me do my eyebrows My body hurts so bad, y'all. My ribs, you know, like, of course, you know, like when you've thrown up, or I mean, for me, this is true. When I have thrown, and I'm just using e.l.f., uh, I use uh, just the powder. I don't use the wax or whatever that other one is. Um, if, I, if I throw up, y'all, my body hurts. And this time wasn't like just a normal throw up. It was, I'm telling you, it was some alien shit coming out of my, I don't know. I mean, I think, I, I'm, I'm, I'm sure it was my gallbladder. 
uh, when you eat fatty foods, your gallbladder is not working like when you're having a, an attack or whatever. Uh, it's blocked. And so, and then this other thing, had, this has a, this is a brush on one end and a spoolie on the other. Kim gave me this and this is heaven. I love it. But, um, yeah, when you're having an attack, your gallbladder is blocked and it's not releasing bile into your digestive system to help break down the food, the fat that you eat. And I ate that chicken, the crunchy part of the chicken, and this is just a cover girl. I mean, it's just, just white, cover girl white. Um... And I ate that, that, the, uh, skin of the chicken, y'all. I, I ate the skin of a chicken and a handful of Cheetos. Yes. I should have just drank some grease. Because that was basically what my stomach was dealing with. I don't know why y'all um putting my makeup on I always open my mouth I go I don't know why I do that and then this is one that it's a it's by wet and wild I guess I should use that white seems like that white was real glittery and I don't I don't want the glitter um Kim sent me this Kim uh, y'all that's another thing. I've got to show y'all a box that Kim sent me. Life has been busy and we've had a million things going. But she sent us, and she sent, I, I want to say me, but she sent us another box. What's right down here at my feet? I'm saving it so I can go through it with y'all. She sent us this box. Y'all, this is, uh, she sent stuff for the cat. She sent some detox tea. I've never done anything like that. She sent me a shirt that's adorable. Look at these, y'all. Tons of makeup, y'all. She sent Dan some peanuts. She sent Clay a Starbucks gift card, y'all. I, I, I don't know what I did to deserve friends like her in my life. You know, not only does she send me stuff like that, which is huge. I, I mean, that's huge to me. But she... Is she's just she's a good friend, you know. I can message her any time of the day or night, and she always, always, always answers me and is very supportive. So I don't know what I did to deserve her as a friend, but I sure am thankful. I'm very thankful for her, and I'll go through that more. Um, um she sent this brush in one of her uh, boxes that she sent us. Uh, I'll go through that and show y'all the makeup. Uh, I used that color, and then I'm fixing to use this color. And I love this. This one, I love this little, is it a quad? Yeah, there's four in there. I just circle it around right there, and then I pull some down this way, and then curve it up that way. That's all I do. And then I, I don't look blended in very well. And then I come back with my other brush. I'm going to circle it around. Pull some this way and pull some that way. Alright, and then I take this fluffy brush and I buff that out, blend that out, whatever you want to call it. See, that just kind of, you know, blends it. I don't know what other word I would use. Smudges it. Y'all, I'm, I'm telling you, I take at most 15 minutes to get ready because I, I just, I don't have time to sit. Oh, I, oh, I do have time, but it's just not one of those things because, you know, I've taken, I work on my house all the time and I'm always sweating and all that kind of stuff. So there's no point in putting makeup on trying to be pretty all day when I'm just going to sweat it right back off. So when I do, what am I doing today? I've got to go put some money in the bank and... Go pay our insurance. And I can't remember. There's a couple of other errands I've got to do. And I want to look decent for it. 
because the poor old insurance lady sees me jacked up every time I come in there because I usually just run in there in a hurry to pay it. So she probably thinks I never get dressed. This is just, this is this, y'all. It's one of these. And I just refuse to, to, to give up on it. I'm going to keep using it until it's all gone because I love it. And uh, I don't want to have to try to find another one. Because even from buying this one to buying this one, the packaging had already changed. And I hate that with a passion when I have to hunt like the same thing but it's in different packaging so you gotta you gotta know what this one says and does and all that kind of stuff so that you can hunt it because it is going to be like a, a easter egg hunt you just gotta yeah you gotta read until you find the same thing you think you had and it's it um it's eyeliner but it also has a little smudging thing like a little foam smudging thing on the end of it i really like that Because I usually put it to about right there. And then I take my little smudger. And drag it to the middle. Look at these puffy eyes, y'all. I tell you, I was sick as a dog. Sunday. We have been so busy. We ran to, um, we ran to Arkansas on Saturday. And, uh, we love getting to see everybody, but we hate that it was for a funeral. But y'all, it was, uh, it was a really nice service. I take it she didn't want a service. And, uh, so, but like some of the family felt like they needed the closure. So they had, uh, truly a celebration of her life it was not a sad thing uh, I, I thought that was really nice the way they handled it and uh, uh, all her boys are so sweet they were all there and uh, yeah it was really nice sad uh, sad that you know she won't be here anymore but really nice in the way that they handled it. That's what, I mean, we said we don't want a service either. Like Dan and I and our kids, we've all talked about it. Well, you know, not quite. Clay hasn't really talked about it with us. But uh, Cameron and Nicole, we've all talked about how we would not like, we all want to be cremated and none of us want a service. So... And, and honestly, I was talking to my BFF one day about somebody else. Let me put my mirror over here and see if that'll help. We were talking about uh, somebody else. I can't talk and do that. This, uh, I can't talk and do uh, mascara at the same time. Hell, I can't talk and do hardly anything at the same time. My brain has gotten so addled, you know, old, whatever you want to call it. I can't think straight, so I got to keep my thoughts together so I can get a full sentence out. But, um, yeah, we I was talking to my best friend about it one day, about somebody, I don't remember who, and I and about being cremated. And I said, um, well, that's what I want. I mean, because we've been, she and I have been best friends, you know, for th over 30 years, around 30 years, maybe, um, let's see, uh, yeah, I'm going on 30 years. Our girls uh, are about to be 29. Yeah, so about 30 years. But, um, and we've never talked about this. I mean, who talk, I mean, who talks about that? But I, um, I'm blending out my blush because I don't like it to be crazy. Anyway, I said, um, I said, well, that's what we want. Uh, we want to be cremated. And she said, really? She said, well, I'm glad you said something to me because, girl, I'd have fought Dan tooth and nail because I just didn't think that's what you would want. And I said, that is what I want. And she said, oh, I'm so glad we had this conversation because uh, I would have said, absolutely not. 
So I'm not even gonna get all these naps these naps combed out of my hair. So, if any of our family is watching and you didn't already know this, we want to be cremated and we don't want a, sur a funeral service. We just don't. That's just us. So, uh, anyway, so I, I was appreciative of how the boys handled it, how they handled their mom, uh, how they handled doing what they knew their mom wanted, but also allowing her brothers and sisters to have closure. I thought that was really, really, I, I thought they were great about it. I thought it was great. So, and I wish we saw, got to see them more often and not at, at, at situations like that, you know, because it's a really hard time. But uh, they were awesome. They really were. They were really, just a really awesome group of kids. And, uh, yeah, so I say kids. They're my age and older, I think. I'm not even sure how old they all are, but I say kids because, you know, now, I don't still see myself as a kid, but we're all still young, you know, young adults, I guess, when that's not true. I'm old as hell, but anyway, cool group of boys. That's all I got to say, and um, so yeah, let me get my, the naps combed out of my hair and get my errands done. <sighs> Y'all, this is my Heifer Please shirt. I, I've already cut the neck out of it and hemmed it. I kind of wish I'd have cut a little bit more out of it, but this will be okay. Um, it's a it's a good quality shirt for six ninety seven dollars. Yeah, cotton. Yeah. Oh, there's oh, it's Taco Tuesday. Taco Tuesday. There's a, a taco truck comes every week and sets up on Tuesday Ooh. for Taco Tuesday. I like that color. I put this is my Anna Sacconi thing, and I put this other thing on here with it. Uh, I don't know if that's too much or if it looks yeah. silly or what, but. I found it when I was going through my jewelry this weekend or last weekend or one day this week, sometime. And I was like, oh, because I broke the chain that it goes on. I'm, a, I'm terrible with chains. Y'all, my body is so sore. I know you don't want to hear me complain about it, but I'm telling you, I can't hardly move between my body being sore and this sore right here in my chin. I can't half-ass talk. My body hurts. And why is it you hit that little hunk of meat right there? That little, it's like a little string that connects your lip to your gums. You always hit that. I don't know why I did that. Uh, looks like as many times as I've hit mine and cut it, it wouldn't grow back. Alright, Clay, let's do... Um, Hi, welcome to Clay's My name is Rowan. How can I make your day look better? He's wanting to try a soup. Do y'all have a sandwich and a soup combo? It's called their pick two. It comes with half of a medium sandwich. Okay, let's do that. And he wants a smoked turkey. Uh, club. The, oh. Let's do the turkey bacon club with. And what are the soup choices? Uh, I'm, I'm not finding them I on the thing see. here. Uh, we have broccoli cheddar, loaded uh, baked potato, chicken tortilla, and tomato basil. Uh, chicken tortilla. Chicken tortilla, please. Okay, and with the tortilla strips on on top or on the side. Um, on the side, please. Side not a problem. And then he would like a uh, medium Dr. Pepper drink. Yes, ma'am. Anything else for y'all today? No, that'll be it. Thank you. Give me $12. Oh. A 10 and two ones oh, or five and two, a five and... I don't got five. That's all I got. Okay, let's... We need tw uh, $12 for Clay. Okay. Five and two ones. Let's do the five. Start oh. with the five. Five and two ones. 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 Nine, ten, eleven, and, and twelve. twelve. Good deal. <laughs> Clay loves buying his own uh, lunch and supper and stuff. It's always good though. Yeah, makes you feel like a grown up, don't it? That's right. Tend into your business. I'm proud of you. Some people don't know how to tend their business, and it's sad because they act like a you know teenager. Mm -hmm. Some they're actually growing up, which is sad. Yep. Let me turn my money all the same direction because you know that gets on my nerves. You, I put my money in my wallet all the in the club. same direction. <laughs> looks like you come from the club with all these ones. No, it looks like a strip gone. club. <laughs> no. 
next. Yeah, month. I guess you'd be going because you wouldn't have all these no, ones if you don't I'll win. No, I'd be broke as a joke. You'd be broke as a joke. Nah, I don't think I ever will go to a strip club. You don't think so? Nah. Why is that? They're just, I don't know, they're too loud. Yeah. And I swear, the, I thought my eardrums were gonna, I don't know, maybe go deaf. When we went to that club down in Houston. Oh my goodness. It was, I had my man up in the club it was, in Houston. All I could do is not go outside. Oh, I should have gotten you some ear uh, plugs. You could have yeah. worn earplugs. It's so loud. I love that that I scene, y'all. I could be all up in the middle of that mess. For loud music. Do what? I said, I see why a lot of people get pulled over for loud music. It's like. Let me tell you how crazy I am because while I'm still sore as hell from throwing up and I'm scared to eat these three little pieces of chicken, the bag of Cheetos is still in there on the kitchen counter. I wanted so bad to reach in and get a couple of Cheetos. Y'all, what is that? Addiction? Uh, what is that? I don't know. I mean, it looks like my brain would go, no, no, I'm never eating another Cheeto in my life. No, my brain goes, oh, girl, there's some Cheetos. You know you want one. But I didn't get any, thank goodness. Y'all look, he's hanging onto the cage with his tail. Don't be scared, little possum. Don't be scared. No, don't be scared. I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm not gonna hurt you. You want something else to eat? Your water is filthy. Boy or girl, I don't know what you are. I see Dan's giving it some nectarine and some cat food. <laughs> are you our new pet? Is that what this is? We're just like a menagerie around here of all kinds of crazy animals. Is that what it is? It's okay, Mr. Possum. You're okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Y'all, it's tiny. It's teeny tiny. I can't, it's, it's just tiny. You need a baby possum.